What's up guys, this is iTweaks here with iPhoneHacks.com and today I'm going to be showing you a new tweak that just hit Cydia called Twickafly. Now this is an awesome update for iOS 7 and what it is is a quick reply and quick compose tweak for Twitter. So you can see that this works with Tweetbot as well. So you can see down here that it's straight from Tweetbot but I have a different emblem. So this is what happens when you get a mention. So if somebody mentions you and asks you a question or anything like that then you're going to get a uh, notification just like this. Now if I swipe then it's going to automatically open up a quick reply. So you can see right here. So it automatically opens up this window and then you can either cancel, open up the application or reply right here. So it's as simple as that. You also down here you have your camera so if you want to add a photo you can use the last photo taken go directly to your photo library or take a picture with your camera. We can cancel it right here. You also have the at symbol, which is just for uh, easy access, a hashtag, and then you have your tweet button for sending the tweet off. Now, if we tap cancel, you can see down here we actually have a quick compose button that you can enable in the settings panel. So if we tap on that, then here's a quick compose. We can quickly tweet something straight from the lock screen without even having to unlock our device. So let's go ahead and unlock the device and jump into the settings. So you can see here as we scroll down to Twickafly, here are all your options. So right up here at the top you have connect, so this is where you're going to add an account. So you can see that I've added my account and you do actually have to set up your Twitter account in Twitter settings right here. So make sure that you set that up right there and then that's going to allow you to use Twickafly. So let's jump back down in here and you can see that you have enable quick reply which is obviously the, one of the main features of this tweak so you definitely want to enable that. You also can enable this on the lock screen like I showed you it puts that little button right there that allows you to just tap on that and then quickly compose a message without having to unlock your device. You can also change the theme so you can see right here that I had the dark theme but we can change that to a white theme as well. And right here we have the quick compose options. So you can add the quick compose button to your notification center. You can also add it to your lock screen and you can actually auto hide the notification center. So when you tap on the quick compose button, it automatically uh, recedes the notification center right up there at the top. You also can change the position of the quick compose button. So you can change it from the left to the right, just like that, really simple. So that's going to take effect on the uh, notification center. So you can see if I pull this down, we have a quick compose button right there. So if we tap on that, automatically opening up the white themed uh, quick compose right there. Now down here we have a install flip switch control center. So this automatically uh, installs flip switch and gives you that uh, ability to actually quick compose directly from your control center. So you can see if we swipe over right here, here's a little Twitter button, automatically pop up that quick compose. And tapping on this is going to install Activator. So if you want to set up a gesture for Quick Compose, then you can do so by using Activator. You guys know how to set up a gesture, so I'm not going to walk you through that. But here we have the Compose Sheet. So you have a Twickify banner icon. So if we tap on that, you can actually change this to the black Twickify, just depending on what you want to use. Or you can use the original Twitter or Tweetbot icon. So just to mention, this does work with Twitter as well as Tweetbot. And uh, I usually use Tweetbot, so that's what I'm using right now. Now, down here we have the Now Playing button, which I don't actually use. I don't see a lot of people using the Now Playing track, but obviously this is in a lot of tweaks, so I just assume that a lot of people do use this. But you can use this, uh, you can toggle on the Now Playing button, and you can change the hashtag right here as well. Now, down here we have the Delivered Response. So basically, when you send off a tweet, do you want it to do nothing? Do you want it to make a tweet sound? a beep, a sent message sound, or do you want it to vibrate? So if we if we just send something off here, let's do a vibrate and we will uh, quick compose from the control center. We're just gonna tap on here, tap test, tap tweet, and then my phone vibrated. So if I do this again, we change it to a tweet. I'm sure you guys know exactly what this is going to do, but I figured I'd show you anyways. Test number two and then you get the little tweet notification. So it's as simple as that. You also have these options to actually tap on the banner notification. So thanks Exenjo for uh, sending me a tweet right when I needed it. But obviously you have the cancel, open up an application, and reply just right there. So you can quickly reply to whoever tweeted you straight from a banner. 
So really awesome tweak, I highly recommend it. You actually get a three day trial with this tweak. So if you wanna test it out for three days, you can do so, and then you can actually decide if you wanna purchase it or not. I highly recommend it, it is a awesome tweak. And if you use Twitter a lot like I do at this point, then you definitely should check this out. So let me know what you guys think about this tweak in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you wanna see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. All right guys, until next time, peace.